One, two, three, four. Okay, guys, this is a new video on Buildify. Buildify is a tool to make your own buildings with Blender. Follow me in this video. I will show you how you make your own buildings with Blender and Buildify. And of course, there's a bonus. So stay with us till the end of the video. Okay, if you are new to the channel, please consider to subscribe. I already welcomed 900 subscribers. It's unbelievable, guys. Okay, so let's go with that further. And please hit the button, subscribe, and the notification button to get good contact like, like this one. So what is Buildify? Buildify is a tool to generate your uh, building. Like you see in my channel, I already do a whole playlist about PCG. You see the procedure in uh, PBG. Sorry, <laughs> PBG, the procedure building uh, generator. There's a whole playlist in the channel, so I leave the link. Uh, above so you can go and check for yourself a complete playlist on how to do uh, buildings under unreal but this one is under uh, blender so let's go with the presentation of the tool so the first thing i will do is just to change the shading right there okay so i will put in shade mode by the way the tool has made, been made by uh, pavel oliver you put uh, a fair price okay so just help the developer and then you go to the download section and purchase the tool because i already downloaded it i have it in my download list you can see it here yeah sorry this is not the one this is the buildify okay and i already put in my desktop the tool so we can go this is it buildify i do have the two files so the way to do that is just you have to copy past your file and start modifying your building according to what you need and to what you desire first things first let's see how you can change for example the size of the building so to do so you have to go to geometry nodes because uh, this building is made with geometry nodes and by the way this is the node all the nodes needed okay so geometry node is the technology made by uh, blender developers it's something like houdini okay or any other procedural tool and you can generate via graphs for example the uh, uh, your 3d assets with this geometry nodes tool so the way to change the number of for example let's say the um, floors in the building is just you go to the properties of the building which you found here okay and from there you start to modify your number of for example floors and you can see that you have to you do have the change of the number of floors okay so this is the first thing to show which is how to modify the number of floors so done you can you can do it directly from the layout view also so we can change for example the module with it but you have to be careful because the with it is according to the models you use in this section so how to change for example and use your own modules you just go to this section and replace the module you found here okay which is this one actually let me zoom in okay so you can see in the interior the modules used by the buildify tool okay so if i go back for example go back to the buildify okay there's an edit mode where you can see for example all the assets used by the building so it will not show the building it will show only the asset used by the building which is all these modules so for each floor you must put the um, the adequate uh, let's say uh, module for that so what if we want to change uh, for example let's say the scale of the um, the shape of the building so the way to do that you just to have to go into um, building base okay and from there just you go to edit mode okay you can see from there that I can change my uh, shape of building by modifying the um, the shape for example I go to edit mode and select for example this edge 
And from there, do for example an extrude. So I'll do an extrude on Y axis and I'll go this way. For example, just to show you that you can do it, be careful to not do to mistake. So I will redo, sorry for that. Okay, and oh, there it is. So if I want to see back my building, I go there and put my building back, and there I do have my building. I think that's it for the presentation of Buildify. So what if we want, for example, reuse this tool because you do have an option to reuse this tool with OSM, which is OpenStreetMap. And let's say that we do want to have, for example, a city that I would like to use the uh, Buildify building with, uh, um, with it. So the way to do that, I will go in my file, okay, and I will open new blender file okay so we can save this one or not okay let's, let's start with the new so don't save okay so let me remove this one okay and i go to my open street uh, uh, plugin which i already downloaded okay and from there what i will do i just need to select new area so the tool will give me to this map where I will find for example let's say my city this is my hometown and I'm from Algeria by the way and let's go for example to my city so this is an it's in Algeria and I'll have to select for example a portion of the my city so let's say I want to take this one so this is real-time data that we have and actually this is a real town okay <laughs> this is not this is not a fiction one okay and let's say i want to bring this area so, okay once i've done that i do a copy so successfully copied and i go back to my tool and i paste right there okay so the way to import your and use the buildify tool with osm is you must go to 2d there's no forest so i will not import anything but i must choose the geometry nodes responsible to generate the building so what i will do i will go i will go to where my buildify uh, file is saved in my pc and i put it just right here okay i will choose the file buildify which i downloaded already i do an accept and be careful to choose building okay so once you've done that you're good to go but the final step is to click the import button so i click import and i'll wait to my city to be imported in my blender so let me put away this and go back and voila <laughs> so you can see that we already started and get a portion of the town which is in the building so if you have do some view issues you must go to view and make the camera back something like 10,000 meters so it will show me show me the whole city or actually the portion i start to see from my tool okay so i will I put a shade one so i think the next step with the tool maybe would be some randomization for example of the um, the importation of the tool okay but i did not manage to do that so i leave it for example for another video okay <laughs> so i think it's all with this little brief introduction to buildify so i hope maybe you like this tool okay so next step would be for example to start diving in the network of buildify and try to understand how it works and from there maybe make some interesting things with the tool so that's it for this today video so i like you help like the content okay uh, please do consider to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification button so i see you in my next video thanks for watching with us